Monster Marine. Today we have something that we don't usually sell. Basket. This is a 2005 Ranger Z20. Looks really nice, really clean. Got a couple little things. I won't lie to you, it's been fished. Boat, boat's my buddies. Um, he takes care of it. He's actually a marine mechanic. Um, believe it or not, if you met him, you understand why. Um, boat has everything on it that you need to go fishing. 75 pound trolling motor. It's got Mercury Pro XS 225. Okay, now power head was replaced about 185 hours ago. Okay, so it does have a new power head on it. Also, the gear case was replaced on it a little over three months ago. So it has just a hair under 10 months of warranty. Factory Mercury gear case, that's like $3,000. Got your four blade power tech prop, which will launch out of the hole. You have a six inch offset hydraulic jack plate. There's a lever on the side of the steering wheel, which I'm sure if you're a bass fisherman, you'll understand. Got these nice Ranger signature little things right here for the Z series. Now, this boat does have padded carpet on the bow, factory Ranger trailer with folding tongue, as well as spare. Now, as I said, he did fish this boat, and he's not a professional fisherman, but he fished in some FLW tournaments and some other stuff. But So the boat isn't perfect. It does have some scratches and nothing crazy. It's not beat to death. Everything works on it. The great thing about this boat is everything works on it. Because it was used the way it was, all the live wells work, all the aerators work, the bilge pumps work. The batteries are within the past six months to a year old. They're interstate, so they're good batteries. All the services, all the maintenance have been done on the engine. We don't need anything. We'll hop inside, we'll show you the couple things inside the boat. It has a great layout. We'll pop these hatches, they open really nicely. Got a uh, fish box right here. I'm gonna go fast. You got dual-sided live well. Everything pops nicely. No perco levers to pull or anything. Got big fish boxes on either side. One on the left, one on the right. Pop that right there. Got battery access right here. You got your trolling motor batteries over here. You have your dual console, which is nice if you're tournament fishing or you're fishing with your buddy. You've got this fold-down seat with a step on it, which makes it nice so you don't ruin the upholstery. Got your, got your driver's seat right here. You got your uh, your hot foot. Hot foot. That's your that's your accelerator. It's like a car. It's got a gas pedal. Yeah. Shifter. Got key uh, keypad start. So you enter your code. You hit start. It'll Boom, fire right up. You got your hydraulic jack plate right here. You got your trim and tilt right here. Okay, you got all your factory gauges, miles per hour, RPM, trim, fuel. Also have your temp, your uh, trim gauge, and your voltmeter. You have your live well selector over here. And you also have your fuel tank, because you have a port tank and a starboard tank. Boat is rated for five people according to the Coast Guard. I don't know if I necessarily recommend that, but that's up to you. Um, boat's in nice shape, as you can see. The interior, I mean, there's a seam pulling right here. The, that, that could afford to be uh, re-riveted, but it's in good shape. Up at the helm, you have good storage. You have rod walker on this side. If I can figure out how to open it. If I pulled the right lever. So if it were me, I'd put labels across them, but that's just me because I'm retarded. Um, Rod storage here. You have good center storage right here. We'll pull both of those. Throw all your tackle trays and all your goodies in there. Keep them nice and dry. It's got a rubber seal around it, so you don't have to worry about getting anything wet. You got more storage over here. Put your cover there, or you can put rods. There is a lot of rod storage because you can store rods on the left over here. So you got slots right here, and then you got your taco strap right there. Uh, rod savers right here on either side, one on the left, which latches right in there, one on the right. You got your leaning post seat right here. Now, the boat has padded front carpet, which the padded front carpet is really nice. Um, I mean, if, if it weren't 40 degrees out, and you're probably wondering why I don't have a jacket, it's because I left 
I couldn't find any jacket I liked, um, and I left them all in people, different people's vehicles. To make a long story short, I don't know where anyone, any of my jackets or sweatshirts went. I lost like six of them in the past two weeks. I went to the store to buy one today. You wouldn't believe the quality or they, they had, I, I could have bought a fluorescent green one if I wanted one or like pink or blue or something, but they didn't have just a normal black one. Just look, it's not here nor there. You have your front controls right here, power trim and tilt. You have your anchor light switch. You have your, uh, you can turn on your live wells. You have your trolling motor with foot pedal right here. You can control it. It's a 75 pound uh, motor guide trolling motor. You got your seat. Really nice boat, really clean. Everything works on it. It isn't perfect. I'm not gonna tell you it's perfect. It does have some hours on it. As I said, the boat, the hull, had, the hull hours are just a touch over 800. The engine has just over 200 on the power head and less than 40 on the gear case, um, which comes with a little shy less of 10, 10 month warranty. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call. We can help with transport or export. If you're one of the guys in the land of Oz, which you guys do like bass boats, feel free to call me. I have plenty of transport connections, plenty of referrals I can give you to customers that I've sold boats to over there. Just be more than happy. Let me know if I can do anything for you.